good morning guys welcome to today today is my birthday it's my birthday i waited a whole month for this and it's here i love my birthday i love my birthday because it's a day for me to celebrate myself every year on my birthday now we have a new tradition and it means putting up our christmas tree i love it we picked it yesterday actually gabby picked it gabby is a really quiet person she's not super demanding she doesn't ask for a lot of things so when she wants to pick something we usually let her so far i've totally just relaxed and it's been glorious but now let's go outside and check on our animals and see what sam's doing it's actually glorious out here and that's why the dogs hate her because she barks when she runs i guess that's when she barks when she runs don't chase her you know the rules she would never dare to chase Molly. See? <laughs> because Molly stands up for herself. I actually don't even know where Sam is. All I know is that when I start like cleaning stuff, he runs away, he hides. <laughs> because he's afraid, I wanna ask him to help me. Don't worry, it's okay. It's a man thing. <laughs> That's what happens when you're married. And the truth is I sometimes do ask him to help me, but he's actually missing. He's probably like sitting in the truck hiding from me. Oh, I see what's happening here. He's getting ready to put up a round bale. Honestly, it is mud season. Our mud is not so bad. It's not like, oh. Our mud is not so bad. It's not like ankle deep or anything. And this is the only area where we have mud, just from this door and around here. It's unfortunate though, I hate it. Hi lady, I'm Stormy Boy. Yeah, my horse is over there. She's really dirty. Dad's bringing you some hay. So I got this thing from the dollar store yesterday when we were there. I wanted to try it out, but basically you can hang it to something. Let's see. It's not food. It's not food. Oh, there you go. It's not food. <laughs> Back away. <laughs> Back away. So, wow, that's pretty strong. So you put your phone in there and then, whoa. I told you to get away. Listen, you're gonna hurt yourself on my thing. Ugh. All right, let's try it over here. Penny, were you rolling in the mud? Tell the truth. I think you were rolling in the mud. All right, I wanted to hang it someplace so that I could like video them, make a little video on my phone to see how it works, but I can't put it anywhere without them getting into it. Don't chew that net. Hi. Where are you? Where are you? I'm at the goat barn. Where are you? What are you doing at the goat barn? Uh, working. Working? Huh, that's what I love. What? what? I'll be there. Wait, if you're there, I need you to get something for me. What do you need? <laughs> um, you know what? Too late, I'm, I'm already at the goat barn. Oh, uh, I Just joking, what do you need? Where, where the lawn tractor is. Yeah. That wood, right? That wood. One piece of wood. Where the lawn tractor is? Okay. Yeah, you know all this good wood there. I need a, a thin piece of wood, but kind of not too long. But, uh, <laughs> okay, so he wants, okay, all right. Four feet long. A thin piece of wood, but not too thin. Yeah, four feet long. Four feet long. Finally. All right, bye. bye. Gabby, I need your help. Did dad call you? No. You just came outside all on your own? Oh, so then you decide. Do that when Gabby goes out, but she didn't know that I was standing right beside her. So wait, I need your help. Mm -hmm. It's my birthday. I need your help. Okay, find me a four-foot piece of wood that's not too thick. How much is four feet? <laughs> I don't know. Okay. <laughs> this is a genius girl too. That's too thick. That's too tall. Yeah, and too tall, because you're five feet. five feet. Yeah. Look at, what about one of these? Those ones right there. Oh, but look at this. this. Or that. Oh my, it's got nails. Hmm. Oh well, there's another one. Oh my gosh, look at this. Does this look four feet? That was perfect. This is around 
but it's so thick. Look how thin He's this one is. He's got to take out two nails. All right, I'm gonna take that one. That one's too thick. And this one. And this one. Nope, that one's too thick. All right, that works. It's too short. Oh well. Take this one too. All right. Tell yeah. Him it's got nails. All right. Look how cute she is, though. Hey, so cute. Oh my gosh. That is amazing. The only reason I noticed it was because Winston just came running out of there. Isn't that the coolest thing? Look, they're not even scared. That's amazing. I love what you did. I love what you did with that. Yeah, they're, they're already in there. Okay, so listen and learn. I brought three options in case one isn't right. Yeah. That way we don't have to walk back and forth a million times. Probably this one is the four foot one. But it's <laughs> thick. You said thin. I know. You couldn't find a thin one? Yeah, I found some thin ones. These are your options. I love what you did though. Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. Tofi. Oh my. I'm trying to call Sophie now because we have a medical emergency in the goat barn and I need her help. She always picks these important times not to answer. To yeah, I love it. And even if it's thin, we could double it's it up. Doubled on the door. Is it? Yeah. I love okay. it. You did a great job. The piggies will love it. It'll be warm in here, especially if the snow is coming this way. And it is supposed to snow this week. Oh, that better be Sophie because she is going to be in trouble. Hi. Uh, do we have like a pitchfork or something? <laughs> Where are you? By the wood pile, there's a pitchfork. Cleaning ladies' old stall. Why? It has a lot of hay in it. Yeah, by the by the by the wood pile where my lawn tractor is, there's a pitchfork lying on the ground. I'm coming up there anyways. You too. We're all coming up there because I need Sophie to help me with something and I called her 10 times and there's like an unwritten rule when your parents give you a phone and pay for your phone. I'm coming right back. It means that you're you are meant to answer if they call you. Okay you miss a call or two. I called her 27 times. When your parent has to walk 17 miles to go and get you because you're not answering your phone it never goes well. <laughs> Care. I told her I want her to help me get this white goat on the milking stand and she said he stinks. Why the, oh. Would have been nice if I could have had to, you come and help me right away. Come on. Whoa. <laughs> I don't know what these boy goats are up to lately. We've never ever had a goat injured before and now we've had two in a month. Come on. Come on. We got to fix you. No. Boy. Come on. This is why goats need collars, but he's a tricky one. I'm going to try and go get no. him a collar. I don't like to put a collar on him because he's always doing crazy things. Oh, but there's a really cute one in here for him. So, I don't know if you saw, but he has a little injury. He has a, not a full horn, he just has like a nub. Hey, Ziggy! And, no, 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 wait, I'm gonna put this collar on him. How are you gonna catch him to Here, put hold the camera. Him? I am amazing. Ellie! Come here, you try. It's my birthday. I can't touch him! We're gonna try it Sophie's way. She says bring Winston in. But look at how cute this is, it's silver, not just gray. Imagine it was like magic. You could just throw it and it would be on him. He knows where he's going. All right. Come on. Dude. She's afraid to touch him because he stinks. It is chaos. Watch. Do you see it? Type yes if you see it. It's getting crazy. <laughs> Posey. Ellie. <laughs> Stop. You're not coming in. How'd he get hurt in the first place? I don't know. But the pig just got jabbed by horns. Mm 
All right, so his little nub is a little bit loose, so it's not that big of a deal, but we're gonna have to do the same protocol. <laughs> did she put her back in the stall? Yes, she's not staying out while we do this. Ellie's just trouble. All right, so. <laughs> oh, let's call Gabby. He's just shaking. Can you start cleaning his pet? How? Use those claws in there. What claws? Can you, when you're done, can you come down and give a shot for me? I'm a little busy at the moment. Can you come down when you're not busy, like in five minutes? Alright, I'm coming down. Okay, thanks. Okay. You're okay. So, we're gonna, so the protocol when you have a horn that's got a little tiny bit of a break is to <gasps> stabilize it and clean it up. So, we're gonna clean it up. Stop. Let me do it. Alright, so basically you just clean it. Let me get them drugs. You clean it, you give them an antibiotic shot, you stabilize it, and you also give them a DD and T so they don't get tetanus. So yeah, that's what we're doing today. Here you go, drugs for you. My question is this, how do you stabilize a horn? So if it was actually his horn, it would be really bad, but because it's just like a tiny little nub and he's already been dehorned by the vet, it's not that big of a deal. And he's barely bleeding. He just he's has a little tongue. Because horns? all the hormones that boys have, they can grow back. Is that why Winston has horns? Does Winston have horns? Oh yeah, Winston, we didn't get him dehorned. I'm against dehorming, dehorning unless it's going to be like a, a show goat. Because they got gifts and horns for a reason. And it's not just for protection. It's also for to regulate their temperature. Oh, I feel sick watching Gabby give the shots. Good job. She pats him. She pats him. Good job. Oh, I was saying about anything. So <laughs> I do not know how we're going to stabilize this horn. Still to me. No, if he moves, it comes, like, it's... Pr Don't touch it! <laughs> yeah, it does move. So the only thing I can think of is to put vet wrap, but wrap it all the way around his jaw. But that's not going to work because he's a goat and goats Make are not going to... Make him a helmet. Easy peasy. Oh, you are a genius! <laughs> how will that stay? Helmet. We'll put a little strap. Wrap it around his head. It's your idea. What cake did you get? Carrot okay, so you guys oh should my hear. God, seriously, I was prepared for ice cream. I, I got, I cake. got ice cream cake. What? Okay. Why, why did you say make carrots? We got two. <laughs> two. Yeah, I you got two that. birthday cakes. <laughs> can you come down to the goat barn? Can <laughs> Can you bring some vet wrap from the horse <laughs> barn? <laughs> Yeah, where is the vet wrap? It's in the medicine ca in like the first aid cabinet. Alright. So, so while we wait for Sam to bring the stuff that we need to make him a helmet, um so last night, so this is what this duct is the plight tape. of a mother, you guys. Yeah, bring duct, duct tape. tape duct tape it down. So this is the plight of a mother. Last night I like two kinds of cake. I love ice cream cake and I love carrot cake. I'm really feeling like carrot cake for my birthday. So I asked Sam, Sam asked me what kind of cake do you no, want? No, you're like, all right, everyone, we're doing a vote. We're doing, so I said, we'll do a vote. And what kind did you want? Ice cream. What kind did you want? Ice cream. I was like, and, you don't and, like ice cream And cake. Sam wanted carrot. So Sam wanted carrot, the girls wanted ice cream. Is I like both. Two? Yeah. Because Dad wanted carrot. So. Dad gets one. I like both. And so I said to him, like, all right, let's take a vote. And it turned out that we were going to, I sided with the girls. I wanted them cake. to have something that, I wanted but them to celebrate my birthday happy. Ice cream cake has always been my favorite cake. It's my okay. favorite cake, too. I and like then, cake. Every year I got it, she always complains. Like, ew, why ice cream cake? I hate ice cream That's cake. That's not true. I never complain. This year, I am, it. No, it's dad who hates ice cream cake. I love ice cream cake. He was the one who introduced me to it. No, it was me. Ask no. your brothers. All of your brothers, except for one. Wait, everybody in our family eats ice cream cake for their birthday, except for Sophie, who I think is allergic and to milk. Dad. I'm not allergic to milk. So, I did have her tested and they said she wasn't allergic to Yeah, I'm not. <laughs> so, in the end, I sided with the girls because, like, that's what mamas do. And I said, all right, let's have ice cream cake. And then Sam said, I'll just get both. So, tonight, for my birthday, we're having two cakes. I'm probably just going to have carrot cake and then maybe have ice cream cake tomorrow if the girls don't need it. Hopefully, you just got a tiny one. So I'm going to have carrot cake and you guys can have ice so cream. She changed her mind. See, she doesn't like ice cream cake. I do like it, but I feel like carrot cake this today. Oh my gosh. I just want one of those donuts. Yeah, dad bought donuts too. I don't like donuts. Neither do I. Oh it's my okay. Gosh, he has bright green. You got donuts? Nope. Okay. 
All right, so we need to make a helmet for the goat. Helmet? Yeah. To stabilize his horn. It's wiggly. It's really wiggly. Go around his neck. Yeah, see how it's All right, but you think he's going to keep that on? It's like half off. Put it behind his ears, too. I say you chop the part that's right. off. That he just has half a horn. We should have brought duct tape, too. Let me go see if I have some. He's so cute! All right, let's let him. So I put something behind it to push it forward. Your right arm is on I don't know. I don't do that. I'm not a weirdo. We're going to keep an eye on it. Like I said, it's a nub, so it's not as bad. Are you stuck? You can go. Cross your arms. What's the matter? We gave him to we gave him the shots. That looks really tight. The worst thing that's does it look too tight? I I can yeah. put my fingers in there. He looks Cross like your he arms. His arm goes on top. Whatever one you feel like. No, because your left arm on top feels weird. weird. All right, let me see. You just do. Yeah, left arm on top. Yeah. Well, how do you do it, Sam? Right arm on top. Yeah. Your left arm is on top. Yeah, left arm on top. She right arm, right arm, arm on top. What do you do? Come right arm. <laughs> you and Sophie are the same and Gabby and I are the same. What? Who wants to bet we go out there and he's got it off already? If that horn comes off, I'm well, going to be grossed out. Though, that's a good possibility. No, I, I'm really good at bandages. Are you sure about that? Someone save the dog. Is you 100% sure? Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully. All right, let us out. Oh, he's got it on still. Stop playing with him. He might have to go in a stall. But I think that'll stress him out more and cause more problems. He hates feed without his boyfriend. Just what I like to see on my birthday. Everybody working hard, cleaning the barn. Birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. It's your birthday. Happy birthday. Through that whole mess, us doing all that stuff, this dog was asleep on the couch. I also made this little thing. It's not that pretty. I need to do something else in the back there, but I just had this little container and I just threw all of our extra decorations in there and made this little thing. Happy birthday, happy birthday. One time for the birthday chick. I'ma mess around by you a birthday whip. Two times for the birthday chick. I'ma mess around by you some birthday gifts. It's your